good morning uh, today we are going to introduce you a new methodology of astrology in the name of uh, alp uh, today we are so lucky to have a new guest uh, she is well known for her predictions and uh, she is using our uh, alp methodology uh, she is very busy Beh- uh, beyond her schedule she has come here to share her experiences in our alp methodology of astrology alp welcome mrs nitya shankar to you thank you for your warm welcome i am so honored to be here uh, to spend my time with you in discussing this alp method of astrology it's a pleasure welcome madam uh, can you uh, introduce yourself how uh, uh, you got introduced to alp okay actually i am a person who doesn't have any much background in astrology I, just the interest and some very bare minimum basic knowledge about the planet's name and uh, some few more information beyond that i didn't have much of exposure but i was always keen to know the predictions from childhood i have uh, uh, my family members in uh, more interested in uh, knowing the predictions so probably that caught over on me so i was always keen to know in that way i happened to watch a youtube video of uh, shri podudai murthy who is the alp inventor and uh, somewhere it uh, created a great uh, interest and intrigued me to know what is this alp method because it was sounding so different and simple at the same time so at that moment i had some questions about my own life so i wanted to have a consultation with him initially to meet him and know if this uh, concept can be learnt so in that uh, meeting with uh, shri murthy sir i happened to ask him if he will be uh, teaching this method to mm-hmm. all of us so he had uh, asked me to leave my phone number and uh, to my surprise in a very short span of two weeks or something i got a call from his office that they are conducting a class and uh, that's how my whole journey began with alp super super okay madam there are numerous methods of astrology uh, methods are popping up everywhere true <laughs> but uh, where is the need for a one more new methodology into astrology fine uh, this was also my one of my reason to go and uh, learn alp because all this while we've only heard of uh, vedic method so many other methods are there which has been followed for many years now and many more new methods have come but uh, somehow the alp method sounded so simple making the complexity of this whole concept of astrology even uh, reachable to a layman oh. without uh, much of a knowledge so that was the first uh, reason which uh, made me uh, i mean interested to learn because i was always scared about this concept so why alp because i felt after learning alp i realized that the results were very accurate oh uh, you can predict it to as close as 10 minutes if you are very proficient you can make predictions at uh, to that accuracy oh. and uh, the thing is the result is consistent with a- any alp astrologer they will all give you the same predictions there is no two different versions of predictions at all so any person who is in distress and wants guidance with any alp astrologer will get only one single answer mm. so that consistency is another thing which uh, really uh, makes this more uh, stand out of the um, among so many Other available methods. Uh, methods so that's what i think is the uniqueness of uh, alp method it needs a lot of calculations right it makes a uh, lot of time to yeah but then uh, we do have the software to help us which does all the humongous calculations in instant moment and uh, gives it in a very simplified form oh. that an astrologer doesn't have to work uh, around the calculations for a longer mm. time and mm. uh, it gives instant results so with the software it makes life so simple and easy and okay. accurate so what more can you ask for true true okay madam can you brief us uh, what is uh, 
in the name alp and uh, in what way it is different from other traditional methods of astrology okay first let me address the what is alp okay alp is actually a short form for akshaya lagna patadi mm. meaning it's a growing lagna method so always in traditional method we would have uh, seen that there is a birth lagna mm. which never shifts right but in akshaya lagna patadi method we are, it's calculated in such a way that every 10 years the lagna shifts to the next lagna mm. as the individual grows every year the lagna shifts uh, in a in a small degree from one uh, lagna point to another lagna point in a span of 10 years it shifts from one lagna to the next lagna mm. so when we uh, calculate or take predictions with the shifting lagna as the center point and do all the calculation based on the traditional method itself you will arrive at the most accurate predictions possible so okay. that is what akshaya lagna lagna patati is all about and uh, to be precisely saying that it is just an extension of the vedic method of astrology but uh, evolution in itself mm. because uh, in ancient days if you see people were all stuck to one small space and they weren't moving much so astrology was confined to only that small space of life for them from birth to the end of their life mm. but now the world has evolved technology has evolved in all dimensions so astrology also has the need today to get evolve itself right uh, so we all want like two minute noodles we want quick fixes in life yeah. so i think akshay lagna patadi perfectly addresses that and there is no doubt about it and i can perfectly vouch for it great it is so interesting to listen from you about elp let us also know something about the brain behind this ideology uh, mr podure murthy sir can you tell uh, a brief about him sure sure certainly that should be the first uh, addressing point actually because all of us benefit from this method it's so important to give uh, due Tribute. respect and uh, honor to the person who was a brain behind this whole concept so shri podure murthy he belongs to a place uh, or a small village called tenadar in vedaranyam district in tamil nadu uh, which is in india so he is the fourth generation of astrologers and mm. he is the 14th member in his family uh, to be uh, practicing astrology so uh, from uh, his background he is a doctorate in astrology and he is also a trained uh, teaching uh, professional and uh, he has uh, been always in search of some uh, firm predictions if you have to say because mm. he was always disturbed by this ambiguity in uh, predictions sometimes two di- astrologers have different uh, point of view mm. and uh, always we are not able to validate which is going to be the truth mm. so he was always wanting to know that one single answer which fits everyone so mm. that was his uh, main uh, urge to Uh, go in search of uh, answers and which led him to alp interesting mm. so uh, and uh, his motto is that he wants to train as many people as possible educate them with this method more than telling predictions if you actually want to learn this message he will be more interested to guide you uh, to become uh, astrologer yourself so that precisely he wants you to balance your own life Mm. because it's so important as an astrologer or as a person to define or refine our lives if you have to say because there are certain True. things that we are all in a different dimension thinking uh, something and doing something but uh, exactly if you say if i have a uh, possibility of buying a bike and i dream about buying an airplane how does it fit it Match. is never going to happen right it's not to demotivate anyone but uh, to exactly say how karma works mm. and it is not by anyone it is all self earned by all of us mm. uh, every individual the best is guide is myself yeah so this alp method precisely he wants people to understand their life path mm. and progress 
in the way the planets allow them to and reach the highest possible, possible in their capacity. So I feel this is very, very uh, uh, reasonable and logical also. If I dream big and I stay disappointed all my life, how successful am I? So True. Th this way, this whole uh, concept of ALP is very, very interesting to guide every individual. First, as an astrologer, it, it guided me. I was overwhelmed by the way this whole concept has uh, opened venues and uh, channelized my own energies in the right direction. Mm. That's when I thought I should be in a position to help many more people who want some guidance, right? Mm. So that is the key uh, thought of uh, the inventor that he wants to create one astrologer at least per family so that they are self uh, contained and they are able to lead a peaceful and a informed life. Wow. To my knowledge, madam, astrology is a very complex subject to learn. Uh, and a lot of people with a good uh, mathematical predictions, precisions and a uh, lot of efforts are needed to learn astrology. That's my assumption. Uh, how can you uh, in ALP achieve uh, one astrologer in every family is possible? Okay. Uh, all this while, that could have been the reality, but now it is just a myth, sir. Oh. In the advent of ALP, I can assure you that it is nothing but a myth. Because without any much background to astrology, I myself as, is an astrologer today. What mm. more can I... So, uh, you are an inspiration. <laughs> exactly. Uh, so, in that uh, note, uh, ALP method is uh, filled with simple formulas. Which is very, very basic numerical method. Any layman can understand with just uh, number sense. That's enough. Mm. All you need is primarily interest to learn. Oh. Beyond that, everything else is taken care by the ALP inventor and the teachers in ALP who are all well-versed uh, in uh, making you an astrologer. So, okay. that uh, guarantee they uh, we can, I can give you on their behalf because it's very simple and it is uh, backed up with a very great software app which uh, is today's trend, I should say. Because everything is app based and even our ALP astrology is app based. Yeah. Okay. So it's so easy to use and uh, the calculations are simplified that any child, it's a child play if I can put it that oh. way. So uh, and uh, beyond that, the teaching method is very unique and very, uh, uh, very beautifully uh, down to earth uh, down to earth and very beautifully explained that uh, every concept is just grained in your head mm. so it's so uh, beautifully taken by all the teachers and uh, we have whatsapp groups which uh, support uh, these astrologers the new astrologers who completed the course also these people uh, have uh, some uh, what do you call uh, experience sharing? Uh, experience sharing, some some uh, Zoom meeting kind of a thing, wherein they can uh, have doubt clarifications if they encounter some unique horoscopes and they are just uh, mm. unable to uh, come to a conclusion, which is very rare because uh, so far such a situation hasn't happened. But maybe some clarity if someone needs the guidance is provided. Uh, on regular uh, manner. Super madam. You told uh, you started to learn this uh, from the scratch. Mm -hmm. You didn't have any, any idea about astrology yeah. to learn this. Yeah. How long did you take to learn this methodology? From day one, you are already predicting. Oh. It's so, mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> so uh, I mean, shocking or surprising. I don't know how to put it, but uh, that's the truth. From mm -hmm. day one, you are alongside doing the practical uh, horoscope predictions. In and practice. Exactly. So, mm -hmm. if I should say that I am an astrologer from the day I entered into the class. Okay. How long did you take to finish this course? Uh, this course actually uh, extended from three months uh, uh, to approximately six months when I completed my advanced uh, course as well. So, in, in a matter of six months, I was well versed with everything. What and all uh, traditional methods... Uh, uh, traditional astrology methods address 
everything was covered in the matter of 6 months in the most simplified manner it's a day, full day program or a... no it's just for a matter of uh, 2 hours oh. per uh, i mean uh, per week or maybe sometimes we used to have two uh, days a week so it's uh, in a it depends upon yeah the it depends upon the availability of the teachers and uh, the course as well super uh, what are the languages available as of now uh, in ALP, we have, uh, the teaching happens in uh, Tamil, Hindi and uh, uh, the other languages are just uh, in the pipeline. English classes occasionally happen, but uh, we are uh, uh, focusing on expanding the language base as well. Many teachers from different languages are being trained and uh, very soon you can uh, see that uh, the lang ALP astrology teaching classes will happen in many languages. Great. And uh, one more thing, uh, it seems uh, Pododi Murthy sir has uh, patented his uh, methodology. Mm -hmm. And have you brought any books on this? Yes, sir. Uh, this ALP method has been patented and uh, there are books available in uh, English and uh, uh, Tamil mm -hmm. as of now. Uh, the other books are uh, Malayalam and uh, other languages, Kannada and all are in progress. So, mm. very soon it will reach the markets for people to buy and okay. read it for And the course. software works in uh, English or in Tamil or which language? It has many options, sir. Once oh. you download the basic uh, free software, you mm. will get to know the languages available in uh, in that app. Okay. So and he uses use the Tamil uh, Traditional method of uh, North Indian or South Indian? It has options for everything. For so everything. Yeah, oh, so super. you can accordingly uh, choose your language and your style. Great. And uh, congratulations, madam. It seems you have been translating the ALP methodology book. Uh, uh, third part, it yeah. seems you have been the translator. Thank you, sir. Uh, share your experiences, madam. Sure. Uh, thank you for your wishes. And it's been a pleasure and a privilege that uh, the ALP inventor has uh, given me this uh, opportunity to translate this book. And uh, it's been a very uh, great experience. My knowledge base actually got stronger by every word which is uh, engraved in that book because mm. reading that book and translating was double study, if I should say. True. So it it was such an extensive uh, uh, content and uh, so much of knowledge is there in every part and every chapter of that book. So if you actually see every uh, lagna, every uh, nakshatra point is discussed in detail that uh, it can be a ready reckoner for any astrologer. Whether you are uh, ALP or not ALP astrologer, you still can buy and have a look at uh, the book and then you will know the intense knowledge in it that will be helpful in your predictions and it will take you a long way because your predictions will never fail. That is the depth of knowledge that these books contain. So I am really honored and privileged as I said that I can't thank the universe enough. You are so blessed. <laughs> yeah. Great, great. And uh, there are doshas, lot of doshas has been uh, discussed in uh, Astrology basicals. Uh, how about uh, Manglik doshas or Ragu De Kedu doshas? These are uh, planetary position based uh, doshas mm -hmm. uh, based on the lagna actually. Mm -hmm. Whereas uh, uh, in ALP method you say the lagna moves, uh, it progresses. And what happens to the positions of Ragu Kedu doshas or uh, Manglik doshas or uh, Shadi Sati? Mm -hmm. Something like that. Uh, all these things are still available in your methodology or uh, is it different from that? Of course, planets are available. So, the doshas are also available, sir. So, okay. the thing is, uh, only uh, uh, shift here is the lagna is shifting. Yeah. So, the, that answers everything. So, mm. your dosha at the time of birth mm. will, will or may not be. Mm. When the lagna shifts to the next position, the dosha also vanishes. Mm. Whereas a person with a Shuddha Jadaga or mm. Shuddha horoscope mm. might be landing into a dosha when a later date. at a later date when the lagna shifts. So, okay. uh, whatever is at the time of birth 
is not the same when that uh, the natal moves to a age of marriage mm. so it is so essential to know that whether it is a dosha horoscope or it is not a dosha horoscope this is applicable across board for all the all the doshas that you can name in astrology okay so the planets are in the same position but since the lagna is shifting so from that point if you start calculating what is in 8th position moves to 7th what is in uh, when after the, after the another 10 years it moves to the 6th position so if it's not a dosha point then it's not a dosha for the natal right so yeah. that's how it is so we are all uh, uninformed and uh, we assume that our jataka is uh, a dosha horoscope and we start looking out for matches to see we find a match also but uh, after spending so much of money and uh, creating a marriage and in the next 10 years when the lagna shifts you see the marriage breaking in front of your eyes mm, mm. so i don't think any one of us would want to do something consciously like that right True. so it is so essential that alp plays a vital role in uh, making people aware of what uh, the importance of dosha and who is having it and who is not having it mm. so that's why it is advised to have informed uh, knowledge and decisions accordingly which will help the people make decisions for a longer uh, time frame super and how about when we discuss about doshas we also discuss about parigarams mm -hmm. uh, do you have parigarams in lp methodology see basically parigarams we don't really advocate because here we have uh, something which is uh, uh, i should say like uh, there are certain things which you have to experience with experience you will uh, find your own path undergo undergo or change also so, sometimes are only you can only experience that uh, that position that planetary thing is for a experience, lifetime experience for you mm. if i can say that mm. so but uh, since pariharam actually gives you a mental peace we give pariharams which are very very uh, uh, simple and which can be done at a very small scale in your daily life like uh, lighting lamps to uh, lakshmi narasimha uh, may, uh, doing abhishekam for uh, your kula devta or uh, uh, distributing uh, holding a pendant holding a pendant or uh, distributing food for some uh, poor according to your capacity Hmm. so it is all in within your means and the simple one which will give you more uh, positivity by doing that rather than spending more money and wondering why no miracle is happening <laughs> around you hmm. this is more uh, simple and uh, transforms you also you learn what is the karmic uh, imprint which is causing this disturbance and consciously make efforts to change it in the smallest way possible in your ability so that's the kind of pariharam we tell people and uh, so far those pariharams has actually has worked wonders mm. in transforming the person and making that experience what they have uh, handled well by them great so it it was so nice to talking with you and uh, you have uh, put us into good enlightenment about uh, new methodology of astrology it is so interesting and it is uh, inducing me to learn more Uh, if at all if we get a one more chance to discuss with you it will be so nice we'll, let us see whether uh, we can have one more time with her to discuss more about our elp astrology thank you thank, thank you, you thank you all